everybody, Ashley Bottoms here, back again with Tales from the Game Room. I'm Ashley, and this is my game room. Welcome back. Um, I'm going to continue on with more Saturn games. Thanks to everybody. A big shout and thank you to everybody at the Saturn UK site. Uh, this video is for you guys. Keep watching. Keep encouraging me. It's working. Um, our next game we're going to review is a personal favorite of mine. It is actually a favorite of every every pretty much every Sega fanatic out there it's Nights Into Dreams it's made by Sonic Team and they're the ones behind all the Sonic the Hedgehog games and a lot of the shining role-playing games that we've come to love so much it's a platformer in the sense but it's 3D you tend to fly around collecting orbs it's a unique gameplay it's quite amusing it's definitely one of Sega's best for the Saturn. If you have a Saturn and you do not own this game, what the hell are you waiting for? Go pick one up. It's that good. Uh, even if you're not a platformer fanatic, you will appreciate what they tried to do here. Um, it's just a lot of fun and I've always enjoyed playing it. Um, let's delve into nights, into dreams for the sake of Saturn. The game is 3D. It's a, the graphics are pretty damn good for the 90s. The object is to, I guess, go in here first, collect your suit. You become knight. And now you fly. You need to collect 20 orbs. The D-pad will move you around, so you can do all these acrobatics with the D-pad. As you collect the, the orbs, you also want to drop them off. You want to collect, I believe, 20 of them in the allotted time. I have not played this game in some time, but I know that circling certain foes and items do certain things as well. You want to collect, I believe it's 20 what they call chips. And you keep moving on to the other levels. This is actually the fun part of the game. It's just really fun to fly around. The meter tells you how many you have left. All this stuff is bonus points, it's great, a lot of fun. You are on a timer, so you don't want to, you know, think that you don't have much time. You have to get the chips. All right, well, as you can see, I'm not as good as I used to be, especially at this game. But I will tell you that it has great gameplay, amazing graphics for the time. The game's very colorful, so it'll appear to young kids as well as adults. Uh, it's relatively easy to pick up and play. You'll find yourself enjoying it in no time. And there's a bit of a skill level, so for you perfectionists out there, you will have something to strive for. One feature I love about this game that uh, I don't know if it's been reviewed or not is that it works off the Saturn's internal clock. Uh, if, if it's Christmas Day or Halloween Day, um, 
specific days of the year, New Year's Day, for instance, it will change the background of the game to celebrate that day. So on Christmas, you'll see snow on the ground. Um, on New Year's, you probably see fireworks. You know, it, 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 depending on what day it is, what special day or holiday that they have built into this game that works off the eternal clock, uh, you will find out. So it encourages, encourages you to play this game on different days and holidays so that you can unlock some of the stuff. Of course, you can always go into the eternal clock and you can change the internal clock to the holiday of your choice. I believe there's like eight or nine holidays that it takes advantage of. So um, you want to definitely check them out. It adds replay to the game and it also adds like a wow factor because, you know, it gives you something extra, which is always great. Um, personally, I love this game. I love that it's in my collection. It's hard to find today. It goes for a little bit more money because it is a very popular game and one of the best games made for the system. So you might have to spend some money to get this game to acquire it in your collection as I have for mine. Uh, if you go on to the sites like eBay and whatnot, you can probably find them there for a decent price. Um, I definitely would recommend this game to anyone that's looking to have a game to play with their children. Or just if you're a platform fanatic. So you definitely want to pick this one up. And uh, I love it. Uh, I can't say enough nice, nice things about this game. So instead of watching me review it, go out and buy it and play the damn thing yourself. You'll see what I'm talking about and I'm sure you'll agree. Um, my show is Bottoms Up Appetite for Discussion every Saturday night live at 9 p.m. on unregularradio.com and reruns every Monday evening at 6.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on cneurockradio.com uh, If there's any games that you would like to see me review, I would love to hear from you. Just respond to this video and let me know. Uh, I also have a few games that I am working on to bring to you in review form for both the Saturn and the Intellivision. So I'm really psyched up about this. Um, and I hope to get those out to you real soon. Until next time, guys. See you on the Game Grid programs. Bye. Ta-ta.